guys, this is Priscilla Nyairia, your African fruit farming queen, and I'm back with another video. We talk about dragon fruit farming. I promise that I'm making my poles for 10 acres piece of land. Welcome to Wonderful Heaven Fruits Orchard. We do all fruits farming. This is where we are making our poles. We want to shift from the timber poles to concrete poles. This is because the timber poles falls because of the weight of your dragon fruits. And we decided these concrete poles will stay longer. Remember, a dragon fruit can stay for more than 80 years. That is lifespan. And if you use a timber pole or something that is weak, it can fall. So that's why we are doing the concrete poles. Your poles should be about eight feet or nine feet and then you will go bury the two feet down as you cement so that it can be strong to carry the weight and at the top here don't forget to leave the space for the two metallic steel this one that's why we have those pipes there so you need the eight feet and an acre feet 800 poles for me here i'm preparing for 10 acres so right now I have 3,000 poles, that is about 3 acres, and a small one going to 4 acres. I'm targeting about 8,000 poles. Remember, in an acre, you install at a difference of 2 meters by 3 meters. 2 meters from one pole to the other, and 3 meters from one row to the other. And if you have the concrete poles, it can carry up to 4 seedlings per pole but if your pole is uh, like the one i was using previously the one for that are wooden you just need three or two seedlings per pole because the concrete pole can carry the weight but the one in the poles that are treated or the other one that are wooden that wood cannot carry that weight that's why it is making adding up into 800 poles in an acre and if you're doing four in an acre you need like 3,200 seedlings in that acre, but if you are doing three, you need 1,800 seedlings in that one acre. Okay, we are putting this three, the 12 metallic steel at the middle, and then we use timber at the sides and also we mix some cement, ballast and sand so that your post can be strong. So that's why you see them like this. We have a metal steel like this one at the middle. Make sure you, are, you have a very good person who does this work, a masonry, so that your post may, may be strong and also something good that can carry a weight that is more than 100 kgs. Remember this plant can fruit even 100 fruits whereby a single fruit can weigh up to a kilo. So with 100 kilos only for fruits, not forgetting that you also have the branches which are also very heavy. So that's why we are considering the poles to be the best for you to do the dragon fruits. So you can also buy this idea from me if you want to invest in dragon fruit farming. Mm -hmm. 